Jellyfish have sensory cells whose internal workings can only be examined with a microscope. One of these organs is the eye, of which the deadly sea wasp has several. And this is what a deadly sea wasp looks like. It's one of the most venomous creatures in the ocean. Contact with its tentacles causes death within a short period of time unless there is medical help close by. From October to May, all the beaches here and to the north are closed. Swimming and bathing is only permitted in the areas that are completely enclosed. Here they call this little monster the box jelly. White-skinned people are at greatest risk. People with darker skin or the local Aborigines are better off. They're less likely to come into contact with a box jelly. The following pictures will explain why. The eyes of the deadly medusa are a key factor. They're hardly visible, embedded in special sensory niches. Only if magnified 50 to 100 times are they identifiable as eyes. In the murky water, the body of the white girl is hardly noticeable, but the dark-skinned body is much easier to see. The medusa is able to detect these different levels of contrast. For the box jelly, this does not appear to be prey, and it changes course. It will not have to wait long for prey, though. This fish has come along just in time. But why are there so many deadly sea wasps here at this time of year? The reason is their life cycle. By October, the growing medusas have reached a size that is already very dangerous for swimmers. In the following May, this generation of jellyfish will die off.